dogfighting breeder found tied up and beaten pretty bad by masked man. A 52 years old Detroit man, a suspected dog fighting breeder, was reportedly outside feeling his dogs when he was confronted by three armed men wearing masks to conceal their identities. The masked man forced him into his home where they tied him up before brutally beating him and torturing him before cutting off his ear and driving away in his van. They tied him up, the dog fighting breeder, they beat him up pretty bad, broke ribs, broke fingers, stabbed him in ice picks, cut an ear off. It's just messed up, the victim's cousin Marty Johnson said. Police believe the man was targeted because of his pitiful breeding operation, which may be tied to dog fighting. When police arrived at the man's Detroit property, they found at least 16 pit bull, bulls tied up outside, emaciated and living in the field in the backyard, and at least a dozen more in the same poor condition in the home's basement. A second property owned by the man was also housing dozens of unhealthy dogs. Animal control was called to the properties to remove the dogs, but family members insist the man was not involved in dog fighting, that he only breeds the dogs to sell them. No, he don't fight dogs, he breeds dogs. No, he don't fight dogs, the victim's brother explained. He has a lot of dogs, it's been like this since we was kids. The man is now recovering at the hospital. He's facing Ms. Jimmy Nur animal cruelty charges for the condition in which his dogs were found. The man who tortured him have not yet been found and no arrests have been made. Do you think this man got what he deserved?